I wanted to do a quick video about Explore. It, it's cross-platform drop-in replacement for, well, Windows Explorer or Mac OS's uh, Finder or even any type of files app in Linux. And it's built to be modern, to look modern at least, easy to use, cross-platform file preview for videos, customizable supports, multiple tabs, and it's open source, which shouldn't be the most important thing, but there it is. Now, at the moment, it's not really in development. It sort of stalled doing to the main developer uh, having to deal with his studies. But I do have it installed, and we're going to open it up real quick and take a look. And as you can see, it's completely transparent. Let's do to the settings. If I go in here and I set this to acrylic, uh, it tends to fix the issue. Okay, so here it is. This is Explore. Now, you can see it's got some ugly ass icons for the drives. I wish it was a little more professional. This seems to be taking after that weird icon theme for KDE uh, Suite, as it's called. I don't like this one bit, but it looks okay. I would prefer if it used the actual icons from Windows itself, because this just does not, does not look very good at all. We go to properties, so you can see nothing pops up. Uh, properties for this, again, nothing pops up. I'm not really going to be exploring my folders here because they're mine and you don't get to look inside of them, but pretty much it does its search and destroy thing. And there we go. I do want to bring you through, I guess, pictures. We can go into my thumbnails and deal with it there. Uh, as you can see, it looks kind of okay having a hard time reading the folder because there's so many things in here but yeah look there's a preview so I hover preview again preview preview this one was my favorite by the way and uh, it does the same thing for videos so I believe if I went into videos and I hovered over this should play according to what it said can I hit preview? File is too large. File size is larger than 100 kilobytes. Sure. No, it's not going to work. Why in the world would you limit the file preview to 100 kilobytes? Anyway, let's go over the settings real quick. Uh, frame style, system default, or default, I'm guessing system default would make it more like actual file explorer. Um, show image as thumbnails, medium grid would probably be best. Yeah, I like medium grid a lot better. Show info, info toolbar, 14 files, I don't know. System font, so you can choose your font, which is nice. And shadow effect, you got Let's put on dark. Oh, light, flashbang, dark plus. Ah, and there's a whole bunch of options here as well. As I said, this thing does not have anywhere near the amount of features that um, a program like Files has. And we'll be going over the new version of Files 3.1 here tomorrow, possibly. Anyway, uh, it's a cool concept, but unless it gets farther development uh, it's not really going to do much yeah and it doesn't look very modern at all it lacks all the features of a modern browser I mean hey look we got tabs yay but like really where's the functionality I hope this year ends up being better for this app and I'll see you guys next time don't forget to subscribe, like the video. I'll see you next time. Did I already say that?